Hello everyone and welcome back to Wildlife Camp and we are here inside of the village next to our Wildlife Rescue Center for African Wildlife looking for medicine for a sick baby giraffe. So this is our very first time that we are in the village. I'm kind of absolutely amazed by how detailed everything is and having a really good time looking around. But we do have a sick baby giraffe that we need to take care of. So let's go ahead and focus. It looks like this guy may be a mechanic actually. Let's talk to him. Oh, wow, he's got a lot of animal supplies. Look at this, he's got fish and bananas. Nice to see you again. Do you perhaps need any equipment or food for your animals? Okay, so what else do we have? We have a blowpipe to, tr what? To tranquilize animals in the wild? Oh my goodness. Then we have a hoof scraper to scrape the animal's hooves clean. We have nuts for monkeys. Each mammal needs fresh water. So this is actually like fresh water for babies, I guess. Grass fodder for plant eaters such as giraffes, elephants, and zebras. Predators who enjoy fresh meat. Then we have monkeys and giraffes who are fond of bananas. And fish is a pelican <laughs> staple diet. Oh, we're gonna run into so many different wildlife here. It's gonna be really cool. All right, let's talk to this guy. It's the pharmacy. Hello, Siri. My name is Ombogu. If your animals should need any medicine, do pop by to see me. I hope you find something suitable. And this is what we need. So the black syringe. So we're gonna go ahead and buy that. So we're gonna spend 50 of our gold coins on it. All right, perfect. Now you have the right syringe in your inventory. Go back to camp and treat the giraffe in the treatment room. All right, and we'll definitely do that. I just wanna check out, I think there was one more person down here. How are you doing, sir? Oh my gosh, look at how cool this is that you can actually like get down here and you can sort of look around. I wanna look around, I wanna look around up close. I mean, look at this. Oh my goodness, I just, I wanna look at it cause it's just, look, you can see like little villages and, and green hills in the background. This is pretty cool. All right, so what are we doing now? You have the, uh, talk to him. You can get a fashion. You can buy a sombrero. What? Okay, he has new clothes and accessories for sale. I bet you probably unlock quite a few of them the more you come by. So we'll check that out later. There's that cool plant I really love. And let's continue moving on through the ferns. Off we go. Entering back into the camp. And let's take care of this baby giraffe. The sick baby giraffe that we need to watch after. So I put the baby giraffe in here. We're going to go ahead and give him a little pet. And then he's going to trust us again. All right, come along, little one. We're gonna get you inside the treatment center. I know you're not feeling very well, are you? Hang on, we'll get you treated. So let's go ahead and bring him into the treatment room. We know what's wrong with him. Uh, now we need to inject the giraffe in the right place, which is apparently right here. It's right there? How do I take the syringe and inject the giraffe in the right place? Okay, right here. I just have to hold it down. There we go. We healed him! Yay! All right, the giraffe is healed. You have done a super job. Wonderful. Can you come out of there looking normal again? <gasps> Look at him. All right, let's tell him the good news. Wow, the giraffe looks so much better already. We should feed it now and then clean its coat. Would you like to look after the giraffe? Alex has already shown you the correct way of feeding and caring for animals, hasn't he? That he has, that he has. So uh, now what should I do? Like clean it? Okay, come here little one. Oh my gosh, what? You're kidding. Oh, <gasps> what is this ridiculousness? Am I seriously riding a giraffe? Oh my gosh. Well, that's one way to transport the baby into its new enclosure. I, I'm a little bit stunned. I didn't know I could do this. Really? I don't know if you can, act can you ride a giraffe? I, I actually have no idea if you can actually ride a giraffe. All right, we're gonna go ahead and get down. And then, do I have any food for the little guy? I do, yes, okay. And then I've got some fodder, so I can come over, feed the baby giraffe. Come here, little one, come eat, come eat. All right, so he's getting some food. He's hungry, wonderful. And now, oh, he wants a banana too. <laughs> I guess giraffes are pretty big, so it makes sense that they would want a lot of food. All right, so now we'll feed him the bananas. And then we'll give him a little wash, I think. Does he want fresh water? He does. Wow. Well, okay, we're gonna take care of you. Don't worry. I told you you'd be all right. We're wildlife. I think we're like wildlife um, specialist. Oh, he wants his hooves cleaned? Do I have that equipment? I do, look at that. I do have a hoof scraper. All right, I didn't even know I had a hoof scraper. Come here, uh, hoof scraper. To do this, your animal, take your animal to the grooming room. Okay, so we need to take him over here to the grooming room. 
And apparently now I have a hoof scraper. Wow, the giraffe, uh, yeah, feed it and clean its coat, no problem. So I guess I'm in charge of this. So he needs to be rubbed down with the sponge first is what it's telling me. So let's get you scrubbed down. Maybe I'll do a better job this time. You just kind of have to like wiggle it all over the place and just cross your fingers. Okay, and now and it'll let you know way up here. So now we need to spray him down, give him a good shower, get all those bubbles off. Yeah, there's a lot of fluffy giraffe baby involved here. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. There you go. Oh look, you can actually see, I think you can see some of the dirt down here. All right, and then you swap over to the brush and then you come in. I think, yeah, look, you can actually see the dirt. Okay, that explains it. So you have to like kind of find the dirt on the creature. There, little one. Isn't that better? And he did want his hooves scraped. I saw that. Oh my gosh. We can actually do this part too. I wonder what this, I wonder if this is like scraping the hooves on a horse. All right, so I hope he's pretty happy now. All right, let's back up a little bit. Now, how are you little guy? All right, we took a care of him. Uh, and now he wants fed again. Really? <laughs> okay, you're really hungry, aren't you? I wonder when the feeding part stops. I, I we're just gonna go through this and we'll see what happens. All right, do you want more? You want some water? Wow, being a mama giraffe is a lot of work. All right, and now we have finally finished up with taking care of him enough. There we go. All right, and you need to stay here. All right, chase him away a little bit. You need to stay here and I need to go talk to Solak again. All right, let's talk to him. You looked after the giraffe very carefully. Would you do me and my people the honor of visiting us? If you agree, then please follow me with the giraffe. Okay, come here, little guy. All right, he's headed out without us. We've got to move. All right, are you happy? Yeah. Right, let's go together. So we're going to follow him with the giraffe. I don't think we should be riding giraffes, especially not giraffe babies. But we're going to go ahead, run this way. All right, was he waiting for us? Right over here? All right, I hope your shoes are strong enough. Let's go that way. All right, keep going. And then it looks like now we're invited to the Masai village. Okay. Masai even, excuse me. And then, all right, this is a large Kenyan nature reserve that we're on. I'm gonna get off the giraffe because I think I'm gonna get judged for riding a giraffe. All right, come on little guy. Come on, follow me, follow me, come on. There we go. And you can see when the affection is at like a uh, high level then. Okay. And how are we doing? Not far to go. Can you see the huts already? Oh gosh. No? Yes. <laughs> I was like, wait a second. I think I'm lost in the wilds. All right. Come on, little baby. Come on. You can keep up with me. He's so cute when he's like, help. Okay. And this is where I live. Welcome. All right. Wow. So we can come in all sorts of places. Let me introduce you to our shaman. He has cured many of us of very bad illnesses. I believe he could help you with medicines when you are not working. Do have a chat with him. Interesting. Greetings to you, my friend. So you healed the, the graceful little giraffe then. I'm very impressed. Now it has regained strength and it would appear to be time to reunite this beast with the herd of the savannah. Please accept a gift from me before you leave. It helps you to withstand the sun's heat. Look, I have a hat now. <laughs> you will find the savannah home of the giraffes to the east of here. May the gods of nature be with you. Wonderful. Okay, so now I need to reunite them. Uh, can I speak with you, sir? Hello, Siri. How are you? Have you discovered any interesting medical plants yet? Please have a good look around. Interesting. I can actually gather up medical plants. Oh my gosh, look at me. I have this baby giraffe following me around. Now I have a sombrero on. Oh my goodness. All right. Can we talk with him uh, anymore? What about you? All right. So they want us to look for medical plants, possibly while taking this baby giraffe, who's a little bit fussy at this point, because I think it doesn't want to be left behind. Look, look, look. I think this is a medical plant. Oh my gosh. All right. Can I gather it? I can. Look at that. In my sombrero, no less. And now the baby giraffe is just like watching me as I'm sitting. <laughs> it's just sitting here. So we can come this way and find medical plants. I guess so we can make our own medicine for them. And then this is the savanna proper. All right. 
You've reached the savannah. Look at the wonderful landscape where most of the world's popular, where many of the world's most popular animals live. You can let the giraffe go now. Just cha press the chase away button. <gasps> Little one, I have to release you into these wilds. We have to say goodbye. Can I take the sombrero off? Let's see if I can. Uh, how about we just, uh, excuse me. Can I, can I, can I remove the clothes? Can I, can I, I could sell them. Can I take it off now? Uh, pick up, sell, clothes, sombrero. I can't take the sombrero off. I am doomed. I have to wear the sombrero. I have been cursed with the sombrero. But look at that. Staring into the distance with my little giraffe friend. Now we have to release him. Well done. You have managed to successfully return an animal back to the wild. This is very good. You successfully released the giraffe back to its na natural environment. The National Park Office rewards you with 100 gold coins for this. You can now go back to the shaman. He will be very pleased. Goodbye, little one. It was so nice meeting you. I hope I gathered up something. I did. I gathered up some sort of medical item. I want to come over here and see if I can find any more medical items really quickly. Although, really, maybe being on my own in the savannah, running around like this... Maybe not the best idea, but I really want to look around a bit more. This is kind of amazing. Do I have to come over here and like find things and find maybe sick animals? What does it look like? Wow. <gasps> There's elephant herds! Look, and zebras! Oh my gosh. If only I didn't have the sombrero on right now. <laughs> and then I could see this. Oh my goodness, and there's even little fluffs of flower, like dandelion heads or something floating by. Oh goodness. Alright, well let's go ahead. We're gonna head back to the village. And let's go talk to the shaman. He might tell us something about the medicine that we can learn to make. So let's dash this way. Whoops, going a little too far. Oh wait, I think I found any other glowy things. There's actually a lot of stuff over here. Oh look, I think there's more glowy things. So we can gather more medical plants. Alright. All right, there we go. Fascinating. All right, we gathered up some root extract. There's quite a few things over here. Wow. Wow, look at this. It's so pretty. They picked a wonderful place for their village. All right, let's go talk to the shaman. And then maybe he'll tell us what we can do with all of these medicines that we're finding. All of these plants. Hopefully they're medical plants, not like poisonous. Wonderful. I see that the giraffe is back home again. Take these herbal remedy plants as a token of nature's thanks. They can chase away the dark spirits of suffering. May the gods of nature be with you. All right. So we gathered up some medicines. A uh, useful medicine for treating bronchitis. Use in the camp's treatment room. Then we have devil's claw extract. Good for treating uh, eczema. Ugh, I can't pronounce that right. But it's basically where you're losing like a lot of your fur because of a skin issue. So there's that. Let's gather up. Oh, okay. Well, you know what? We'll gather up more medical items in a little bit. Oh my gosh. And there's more there again already. How fun. I can't wait to come back and gather those up. I hope I can get this sombrero off my head. Please let me get it off my head. Is there any way I can get this off my head? Task, go back to camp. The animals, uh, contentment is pretty high. Training. So you can also train them. I wonder if that's what this is about. Training items, medicine items. Get off my head. Get off my head. I wish I could get the sombrero off my head. I don't want to be wearing a sombrero. Oh, well. I guess it's supposed to help me with... I guess it would be a little rude to rip it off my head after they just gave it to me, too. All right. Alex is waiting for us. So let's go say hello to Alex. Now that we have released our first animal. How exciting. Alex, where are you? Oh, I think he's hanging out with the lion. All right. Let's run up. Check on Alex and the lion. Is this the right room? I think it's the next one over. We have a lot of little spots they have set up so that we can get lots and lots of different animals here. All right, let's run up here. There he is. Hey, Alex. All right, mission done. Wow, what a ridiculous hat. Nice to see you again. Zimbabwe will be ha or Zimba will be happy. I have got an idea. Could you go and buy some food for him at the village? And as you know, it's west of here. All right, so now I need to go buy some food in the village. Oh, look, and there's a lion cub. Okay. I want the hat off. Thank you very much, sir. Ridiculous hat indeed. And I think I'm just stuck wearing this thing for a little while. Come on. Maybe I could sell it. Ah, get off my head. All right. Well, it's stuck on my head. We're back in. Now we need to... Oh my gosh. You guys. You guys. Oh my gosh. Look at that lion cub. Ah, don't look at my rump. Look at the lion cub. Oh my goodness. Okay. Let's turn that. That is so cute. I can't believe how nice that looks, too. All right. What was that? 
Wow. Look at him. Look at that content little guy. He's just snoozing away there. I can hear elephants in the distance. <gasps> There's another entrance to the area over here. Are there connections? There's connectors in between the different er spots. That's going to be so useful. Well, all right. So next time we're going to go ahead. Oops. Nope. And next time we're going to go ahead and we are going to go buy some meat for Zimba. Apparently we can learn something about this. <gasps> we get experience and we can level up in different things. Keeper, healer, trainer. Interesting. Interesting. All right. So we will figure out all of these things and continue on with more tasks here in Wildlife Camp next time. So I'll see you guys then. Bye-bye.